I work on the grounds, groundskeeper here for House of Rayford. Hey, my name is Curtis Carr. I am the Director of Community Outreach for House of Rayford and its nonprofit affiliate, Flock. Late 2014, I had some trouble at home with you know, some of my family members and sort of went downhill and got sort of got put behind bars because of it. I talked to all the men and people that was in there and the warden and they told me, they said, a good place for you to go would be downtown Greenville at a rescue mission called Miracle Hill. I remember when I first met Joey, he had just started working here and had, he was basically homeless. He had gone to Miracle Hill, he had no one uh, in his support group, he had really nothing to his name and I remember his self-esteem was, was kind of low. Um, but the more I built a relationship with him and the more he got integrated into our, uh, our company and really found a place uh, on our staff and was encouraged by some of his leaders and excelled at his job, you could really see his personality come out more. And he began to share with me more of his story and more of his trials and more of uh, some of his successes. I'm mostly a groundskeeper. I keep up grounds, you know, pick up so whatever needs to be disposed of, I throw stuff away, just try to keep everything looking good for the owners and visitors and, you know, just try to make it look good for them. I just kind of got moved out and tried to stay here and work and just tried to stay focused on ahead of myself and not, not the past, which caused me to end up in that shape. Well, I just got to stay on the right track and can't give up because giving up's the worst thing you could do. When we identified our main focus areas, uh, Miracle Hill was a no-brainer for us because they cover all of those areas, you know, and, and being a long-standing ministry that does things with excellence and um, with the faith-based component, uh, we were automatically drawn to them. Um, we've supported them with financial contributions, sponsoring um, a lot of their annual events, fundraisers. Uh, as well as some one-time projects as, as they've come up. We've uh, donated product to help offset some of the food costs that they, uh, they have with caring for so many individuals on a daily basis. I feel like we have a part to play in the testimonies and the miracles that are happening there all the time, and it's really encouraging to see that. We're thankful for that, and, and that's part of what we want to do with House of Rayford and Flock is just find people who are doing the great work and see how we can just get behind them and link arms with them and not try to reinvent the wheel, but uh, just partner with one another for the good of our community.